Hello and welcome to our channel. My name's Jade. I'm Matt. And this is Keeping Up With The Kennys. Today we are going to talk about some frugal Valentine's Day ideas. Mm -hmm. Because believe it or not, Keeping it true. <laughs> Keeping it frugal. Cheap just oh, sound, frugal. you don't yeah. want to say that on Valentine's yeah. Day, Matt. You're not cheap, you're just frugal. and Budget friendly, but <laughs> prosperity plan. Friendly, prosperity plan friendly. There you go. Cause but, keep it cheap for the boys for their prosperity plan for Valentine's Day. <laughs> we do want to allow for couples to have fun, but also stay to their budget mm -hmm. or to just maybe have some different ideas of things that cost zero dollars and things that you can do that are a little bit cheaper of an option all the way up to things that are a little bit nicer of an experience, but you know, are going to cost a little bit more money. We're kind of going to yeah. go over a wide array. <laughs> Unless you're that things. guy that breaks up with the girl a week prior to Valentine's Day. Why are you going to say things Well, like there's that? guys that do that. Stop it. I don't, and you shouldn't. Maybe that's their prosperity plan. That's their budget. You ain't gotta, single? <laughs> yeah. So you don't have to break up with them because some of these are free. So there you go. So there you go. <laughs> don't judge me. Let's get into this video. All right, so the very first thing that I have on this list is to either make food together if you have a favorite recipe already or you enjoy a good steak or you have maybe a favorite pasta dish. Matt and I actually recently just discovered at Costco they have a seafood medley that mm -hmm. has like mussels and scallops and shrimp in it. And it comes frozen in a bag. Yeah. And we just, we cook it up with some oil, ghee, and lemon juice. And garlic. And garlic, and it's killer. And it's bomb. It's really and I good. said for Valentine's Day, we could make one and make it into like a pasta and make like a nice pasta together. Mm -hmm. So that is definitely an option. Definitely look at places like Costco or order pizza like Matt would like to do. I know. <laughs> He's not, you know, like a, a five-star restaurant kind of guy. No. He's more like a drive through Costco at Chick-fil-A kind of guy. Costco pizza. Yeah. <laughs> he does. He likes Costco pizza a lot. I do. <laughs> so the other side of this is an online cooking class. So I actually stumbled across, upon, Whichever. I was mixing both of those together. <laughs> I stumbled upon this website called Sur La Table, and it is, we haven't tried it, but it looks super cool, mm -hmm. and they actually have online virtual cooking classes. So the whole weekend of Valentine's Day, because Valentine's Day is on a Sunday this year for you that don't know, and... So Friday, Saturday, or Sunday, you guys can sign up for a cooking class. They have all kinds of different ones from a surf and turf to, you know, um, pastas and steak. And you, when you purchase the class, it gives you the ingredients for the lesson. So you can go out ahead of time, purchase all the things you need. And then the day of, you just do a cooking class together in your house, which I think... Whoa. Disregard. <laughs> which is would actually be really good because I'm gonna be a little transparent sometimes I get frustrated in the kitchen so if I don't have step by step sometimes I don't get too happy so it's a lot easier for Jade and I to cook together if there's instructions a lot laid out for you well and this was really cool because it's actually a zoom call so you can ask questions or ask to slow down if you need a second that's cool so it really it, it's 29 dollars. so i think that that's pretty reasonable yeah. of a date i, I mean yes really, you buy the really fun you buy the food on top of it but you get to do it in your own home and then yeah. afterwards you enjoy your meal together. You're not at a restaurant that's overcrowded because it's Valentine's Day, you know? But not because But not because now stuff. it's socially distanced. Yeah. But I just, I really love the idea. This really seems cool and we might actually check it out for Valentine's Day because I think that it sounds bomb. Bomb. <laughs> 
bomb.com. All right, so another option is probably your obvious, your movie and popcorn deal, just keeping it simple. So maybe after you cook the dinner, just make some popcorn, which is actually what, how we like to make it. We don't buy bagged. You just buy the kernels and you just throw it in a pot with some oil and put a lid on it. You shake it up a little bit and get yourself some fresh popcorn. So we're in a movie and some eat some popcorn. <laughs> And how much cheaper can you get than that, really? Yeah. I mean, popcorn costs practically no money and red boxes a little bit over a dollar. So, Or if you just own the movie. Or if you own the movie, or if you have Netflix or anything like that and you just watch a movie on a streaming Everyone service, you Netflix. are. <laughs> Not if you have Netflix. You have Netflix. Saying that, like, I don't Let's know if all on. countries have You Netflix. have Netflix, number three. <laughs> All right, so number three is to get some fast food, whatever is your favorite, and go drive around in your car and go sightseeing in an area maybe that's a little bit further away from favorite you. Favorite pastime. I literally love to do this, not on Valentine's Day. She cake. loves to ride. She doesn't drive. I drive. She enjoys I enjoy the scenic route, being which is fine because I like driving. Around the Chauffeured life is for me. Around the country. Yes. Local country of the wilderness. Yes. It's just, it's fun. I mean, you get to see really cool buildings near you. And yeah. if you live where we, you know, like around an area that you can get to the country pretty easily. You just drive. Beautiful and back roads. Choose this can... road. And then which way? Left or right? And then we choose this way. And then Fill up your gas tank first. Magically, we end up five minutes where we began an hour and a half later. Yeah. On accident. It's awesome. <laughs> And so that's a really fun idea. You can have really good conversation together about your dreams for your future, your financial plan. That is really fun. That could maybe be a little higher end of cost because of gas is going up right now. That's so true. Might be a little more costly. Yeah. So what if you're driving around enjoying the sights and then you end up in some beautiful country with some bed and breakfast in with- some beautiful country. Wilderness, <laughs> you're out yonder, you're somewhere, you're in the country. In the country. Not I meant like a in the country. country, not a different country. And you love it, and you find a bed and breakfast with apples and syrup <laughs> and breakfast. I don't know, I thought that's kind of like a typical thing, right? I don't know. Stay at a bed and breakfast, stay at a hotel, stay out yonder and enjoy the evening and. Yeah. Wake up the next day and go out and visit some more. So maybe that's just a little weekend trip on Sunday. Maybe you go Friday, Saturday, Friday after you get off work, head out there, stay Saturday, and then you drive around and enjoy the weekend and yeah, pick apples. And pick apples and eat syrup. <laughs> that would be fun. I would do that. That's another idea. Pick apples and eat syrup. <laughs> I That sounds like my type. After pizza. After pizza. Pizza, apple syrup. <laughs> It's like Buddy the Elf. Apple syrup on the pizza. <laughs> that Dessert could pizza. be good. That would be good. <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> I got it. You're up. All right, so another one on this list is I just researched these for this video because I was like, there has to be something like this. I can't be the only one who's thought of this, <laughs> and I'm not. And that is youtube dance lessons so there's like pretty much any type of partner dance like the tango or swing dancing or whatever you want to do there is a dance class for you on youtube and Everything like how cute YouTube. is that matt and i used to do this all the time we haven't recently but like he has a playlist which is so sweet because he's just the sweetest little man i love him but he has <laughs> thanks <laughs> I'm the sweetest little man you've ever met. <laughs> he just, he is so kind and caring and awesome. And he has like a list of the songs that he used for his proposal and they're just saved on his Spotify account. And like, he'll just pick one and we'll just dance to it. And it's nice and I love it. And it's sweet. And it. I don't know how to act right now. <laughs> so I'm just gonna sit here staring at you guys. <laughs> In the camera. But it is. I really enjoy it. 
Maria had some other ideas of things you could do, which is Matt's mom <laughs> during this. <laughs> which is... Who's Maria? I know. Who's Maria? Uh, should I say it? What? <laughs> say what? The ooh la la dancing. Oh my... No. <laughs> no. Is Move on. <laughs> To she the said other. you could do it nudie because oh it's Valentine's Day. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my if God. you want. That's totally up to you. Or if you saying, don't want to. <laughs> I'm just saying we do it clothed. <laughs> we're but we're gonna get censored. <laughs> other ideas. So. Okay, can we move on to the next one, please? What's the the, the next one is not much better. The next one Matt wants me to do because he doesn't feel comfortable <laughs> saying it, which is to stay home and have a little jammy night, light some candles. Fire is such a good, like, mood setter. Controlled like, fires. Putting, yeah. Well, either in your <laughs> fireplace. <laughs> you just fire. Set a flame to the kitchen if you did the dinner or cooking thing and you suck at cooking. S like get some big pillar candles and light a fire if you don't have a fireplace or if you have a fireplace light the fireplace have a little jammy night you can buy some essential oils or massage oils give each other massages or whatever you know mm -mm -mm. just have a good time it'll be fun i think that'll be fun matt's like all weirded out by me saying that but like who doesn't like a massage and massage oils for real probably because you always get the massage and I don't so that may or may not be true yeah <laughs> good for me great idea I'll again I'll take the pizza and movie I told everyone how sweet you thank are. you for tuning into this video like and subscribe no stop it we have some more sounds like all three are yours but sorry it's a love day, Matt. Mm, it's about a love. Yeah. So, if you live out in more rural areas, or you can travel and go on a hike, go on a day hike, go out in the evening if it's nice, and go out. And if you live in the city, you probably aren't familiar with things called stars. <laughs> so, you can't see them. yeah, you go out yonder and you can see them, and it's actually really relaxing. Go just find an open field, lay down, and look at the stars, or go on a Go on a walk and get some exercise. Get out. And Have a little day picnic free. together. Minus the gas to get there, but it's free. Yeah. Like, have it's a It's nice... fun. We like doing that. We I do. like going outside at night and hanging out. Hanging out. Hanging out. Hanging out with, with the, the stars. stars. <laughs> there you go. We complete each other's sandwiches. Oh. That's I didn't know you were going to say that. So on the other side of things that you can do together is a more costly thing because it's going out to eat if you are wanting to venture out into the real world right now or if where you're at is not locked down because I don't know all of the things all of the places Good so we aren't right now here you can go to restaurants and sit and dine in mm -hmm. so we have that option available to us if we want to so one of the things that you can do is we are avid Grouponers most people think dining out there is no discount for that yeah I feel like Groupon is well known but I also feel like it's slept on in the same way yeah like people if you want to go do something check Groupon yes always Immediately. so there are really good deals. One of our favorite restaurants here in St. Louis is called Drunken Fish. It's a sushi place. Really and we good. only ever go there when we can get a Groupon to go there because it ends up being half the cost of yeah. what it would normally be. It's really good quality sushi. Yeah. Like, and it's I like eat a, a lot of sushi. It's so a nice. It's it expensive. It's always been like a date night. Like it's a nicer restaurant that we Special dress up honor. to go to and we have fun and, you know. <laughs> yeah, but we are homebodies. So are. we get dressed up, we go out, we eat, and then like, all right, let's go home. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> let's go much. and watch a movie. <laughs> it's true. It is. But so that's a little bit more costly. And then this other one is a little bit more costly as well, is that you can, if you're a Costco or a Sam's Club member, they Costco's have um, discounted 
gift cards for restaurants. So you can buy $100 worth of gift cards for either, I think it's $66 or $75, depending on the place. At least that's what they are here. I'm sure it differs depending yeah, it on the area you're like at. How much or... But that means that you can, you know, all of the ones for at ours are a little bit nicer restaurants. So it's some of the nicer Italian restaurants near us and some nicer steak houses. So you can get $25 off, so 25% off of your meal, which is pretty good when you think about the fact that normally you don't get discounts when you go to a yeah, restaurant. I mean, it's a coupon, I mean, so, it's $20. Yeah, so that's another thing to think about. Just kidding, one more. We have a fire pit out back, and if you do, or if you don't, I don't know, can't answer that. If you do, have a little bonfire. We love having bonfires. You can get a pizza and then you can do s'mores yeah. on the bonfire and look roast. at the stars, roast s'mores, roast marshmallows. or do what she does and set them on fire and turn them into charcoal. Ugh. Okay, comment down below if that is not the best way to eat a marshmallow it's from not. You, a you campfire. It's not, you make it, just brown it. You don't... No, you stick it into the fire, it lights in flames and crusts the entire outside. So good. No, oh. it, no. Man, you... I want a burnt marshmallow No, because Kingsford doesn't make marshmallows, they make charcoal. Whatever. Whatever. I disagree. Debate it, put it down. Down below. Am I right? Or is she right? Am I right? I'm always right. You gotta right, choose. So. Yeah. Well, <laughs> she'll win. She always wins. That's all I got. That's all I got too. I think that that wraps up this video. I hope that you guys enjoyed this one and that you have some ideas now that you can do for your frugal Valentine's mm -hmm. Day. Let us know. Let us know in the comments what you plan to do, if there's anything that you plan to do that we didn't mention down below. We read and respond. We do to pretty much every comment. Yeah. I try and respond to all of you guys because I'm so excited that we're growing a community. Yeah. We definitely, we at least read every single one. And I try and at we least heart them. Comment as well. Everyone too. Yeah. So I hope you guys have a good week and we will see you next time. Thank you. See ya. Bye.